Okay, team, here's what's been happening on Ghost Rider. The facts. First, a lot of strange things have been happening to Jamal. Like when he was walking home one night, he saw these really weird creatures in the park. Later, he got a mysterious message on his computer that asked, where are the children? Are they all right? Children? What children? Who are you? The next day, when Jamal checked out where he'd seen the creatures, he found a note written in code, Zergvet. Then a button that said Fabto. Fabto. And Fabto left a warning in Jamal's locker. Near the park, after dark, you were there, so beware. Fabto. And strange things have been happening to other kids, too. Someone swiped Gabby's backpack. Hey, wait a minute! Did you tell the teacher? Yes, Papa. A couple of other kids have also had their backpacks stolen. And you're not gonna believe this. Lenny's songbook kind of went crazy. Whoa! Then things got even weirder for Lenny and Jamal when they got another mysterious message. Nobody else sees that. Shh! People will think we're nuts. Where are the strange messages coming from? What are the weird creatures Jamal saw? Who is the backpack thief? And what does Thabto mean? This is just weird enough to be really interesting. Get a pencil in your casebook out and keep track of the clues, because things are about to get really crazy. Why do you not answer me? We are answering you! Do you want us to speak louder? What do we do now? I don't know. Jamal? Uh, yes, Grandma? Everything all right in there? Yeah, mm, sure. I brought you and Lenny a snack. I wonder if she can see it. Yeah, I wonder. Thanks, Grandma. Yes, thank you, Mrs. Jenkins. What was all that shouting about? <laughs> oh, that, yeah. That's just some crazy computer game. Oh, yeah? Let me see. Well, where is it? Uh, it, uh, it was getting too complicated. Oh. Well, um, enjoy your snack. She didn't see it. How come we're the only ones? Who are you? What do you want? I don't think he can hear us. Wait a minute. It's writing to us. Maybe we should write back. but he could read and write. Are you a person or an alien? You've got to write it. Can I write some? Sure. Computer? Brooklyn, New York. 
door. The United States. Is that enough? Earth. Still feel lost? Type it. Wait! What's wrong? to get him back. But how? Look, what do we know about him? Well, the first thing he wrote was, help, 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 help. Where are the children? He sounds scared and worried about children. What else can we say? Well, he warns us to be careful after dark. So that means he cares about us. I think the most important thing is that he feels sad and lonely. Yeah. Right after he said that, he disappeared. So let's tell him he isn't alone. Tell him we'll be his friends. That might make him stay. Quick, let's do it. It may be too late. What else can we say? I bet this will do it. We'll write to you. <laughs> we did it! What do we call him? I don't know. He said he was a person, or at least he used to be. You mean he's a ghost? I don't know. Maybe we can call him... Uh... Ghost person! Ghost person? <laughs> like what? Yo, ghost person? Okay, how about ghost writer? Now you're talking. He's a ghost, and he writes to us. Ghost writer. Let's see what he thinks. Yes! <laughs> Good job, honey. Right. Here's some books about New York. You can read up on them while I finish my... <laughs> Jamal, you know you're talking to yourself, don't you? Oh, boy. Just in time. I thought I was gonna have to eat alone. Here, taste. How's my special sauce? Mmm, makes me want to eat forever. Mmm, <laughs> you're right. It's just about perfect. That uh, down.
Town Beat magazine sure has some good recipes. I am a master chef. I never work from recipes. I work from the heart, from the soul. <laughs> so, you made a new friend today, huh? Do. Do somebody else at your mom's? Uh, his grandma. You hung out with his grandmother? Yeah, kind of, sort of. She brought us snacks when we were playing computer games. She's real nice. Well, that's great, Bips. Hope you didn't spoil your appetite. Oh, no, I'm so hungry I could eat a horse <laughs> made from your specials. What? Huh? Do I have spaghetti in my chin? <laughs> Sauce up my nose. <laughs> I do, don't I? No, Dad. Don't laugh at your old man. Help him out. No. Really. That's what I get for reading while I cook. Is that better? Huh? Lenny, hello. Yeah, Dad. <laughs> you look great. <laughs> yes, interception. Mm. Ah, yes. Instant replay. Sucker. Hey, what happened? Ghost Rider. What's he writing? Vapto. American Flyer Sport. Vapto. Ghost Rider Thapto? <sighs> Something bad, I think. Where did you read about Thapto? You mean you're reading another Thapto button? How do you find it? Can I go to the video arcade? Just a second. I want to show you something first. <laughs> Seeing your sister take your great-grandpa Ezra's old trunk off to college got me to thinking about some of the things down in the basement that belonged to my father, Leonard Harmon. And this is one of them. Whoa! <laughs> His trumpet! Uh-huh. So beautiful. Isn't it, though? Can I take it out of his case? Sure. Hmm. Practiced every spare chance he got, my daddy did. Wrote some pretty music, too. Shooby dooby 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 doo doo. 
<laughs> Lenny's dad's a musician, too. And Lenny writes songs. Oh, really? We'll have to go and hear them play sometime. Mm-hmm. Where'd you say you wanted to go? Oh, the video arcade. Oh, okay, but don't stay all day, though. I won't. <laughs> Grandma? Yeah, sugar? Do you believe in ghosts? Well, I hope you're not planning on leaving me here by myself with that question. <laughs> no, I don't. Unless they're the good, friendly kind that live in memories and things. Why'd you ask? What have you been seeing lately? Nothing. Just thinking. Bye. By yourself. Double defenders. Yeah, tournament next week. I know. Hey, wouldn't it be cool if the double defenders were real? I can actually play in the tournament. Oh man, that'd be awesome. All the superheroes competing against each other to find out who's best. Yeah. I bet the I bet the X Men wouldn't need any quarters. <laughs> Neither would the Turbo Heads. Hey, I wonder who will win if the double defenders won against the Turbo Heads. Oh man, are you kidding? The Turbo Heads would blast the double defenders out of the galaxy. I don't know, man. Those double defenders are bad. They have two heads and can see behind themselves and everything. Yeah, but the turbo heads are supercharged. They got engines where their brains used to be and lasers by their eye sockets. <laughs> yeah, I guess you're right. Busted. No more quarters. New guys around the block. Aren't they a singing group? No, they're kid detectives. Oh. Hey, speaking of detectives, Lenny Frazier tells me that you're uh, good at solving puzzles and mysteries and stuff. Uh, not really. I'm great at it. <laughs> All right, the greatness. Why don't you take a look at this message? Lenny and I think it's a code. What do you think? Yeah, it's a code, all right. Pretty tough one. Hmm. I found it yesterday morning in the park. Um, this button I have here, too. I also saw these creepy-looking creatures moaning like out of a horror movie or something. Yesterday at school, I found this uh, note in my locker warning me to be careful. Signs, Babto. Hmm. Now, this is what I call a mystery. What do you say we take these codes over to the world-renowned Fernandez Laboratory for further analysis? <laughs> I'm with you, my man. I just hope your uh, laboratory is equipped with a kitchen. <laughs> You know, codes have been around, like, forever. Once we find out what kind of code this is, we can start to decode it. How? Oh. There are two different kinds of codes. One that replaces each letter with a different letter or a number. Like this. Mm. Take the word eggs. See in this code, E is five and G is seven. Oh, I get it. So a different number stands for each letter. Right. So if you want to write eggs in this code, you write five, seven, seven. And S is 19. Right. There's also another code where you substitute letters for letters. Maybe A could be E. Right. Then there's a whole different code. We scramble all the letters up in a word, like this. 
Think the word eggs again. Let's scramble the letters up. And you get scrambled eggs. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Let's try that out on our coded message. Look, I see one already. See this? This could be rug. Great. And I think I see zebra. See, there's a Z, an E, a B, an R, and an A. Yeah, but there's a P, R, and L left over. Oh, yeah. This can't be a scrambled code. Why not? Because no matter how you change these letters around, you can't make a word. Look, there's a Q, but there's no U. And Q and U go together in any English word. Yeah, I see. That must mean that this code... Replaces letters with different letters. We're going to crack this code. I can feel it in my bones. Alex, come quick. I need your help. I think I know where my stolen backpack might be. Where? In this junkyard, where my friend Katya found her backpack. She said they only took her money. So maybe there's something left in mine, too. My, my trivia book, or my pencil case, or my notebook. Hold it, hold it. Slow down, all right? Why? We got to get there before it's too late. The least you could do is say hi to Jamal. Oh, sorry. Hi, Jamal. I'm Gabby. You can come, too. Now let's go. Four more kids in my class alone have had their backpacks stolen since last week. The whole school is starting to get scared. And it's bigger kids that are doing the stealing, too, like middle school or something. Man, what a drag. But you don't ever see their faces because they wear these weird-looking masks. Weird masks? Yeah. These humongous, bulging eyes and snotty, twisted noses and warts and moles on every inch of their skin. All right, all right, we get the picture. Yep, my lunch money's gone, all right. But everything else is here. Thanks, big brother. You too, Jamal. No problem. Well, see ya. Hey, where are you going? To tell Tina and Nguyen about this. She's making a video about me. I mean, the thefts. But Pa says you have to stick with me, especially when you have your backpack. But Tina lives right here on this block. Just three doors down, don't worry, I'll be okay. <laughs> <sighs> oh, boy. Hey. Find something? Yeah. Another back. Pack. What's wrong? <laughs> what is that thing? Did you see that? What do you mean? Of course I can see it. What do you think, I'm blind? Alex, lover of mysteries? Oh, wow. Jamal, what's going on? It's Ghostwriter, man. He's writing to you. Ghostwriter? 